So my name is Etienne Deveillé. Uh, I am the director of research uh, uh, here at Africa Rice, based in Boaké. And uh, today we are very pleased to host the workshop uh, for the launch of uh, uh, this new initiative uh, that we, we named the, the Rice Compact for the value chains in uh, uh, this new project uh, supported by the uh, African Development Bank. Uh, we have delegates from uh, uh, many countries around Africa, from uh, West Africa, from Madagascar, from Nigeria, from Burkina. And uh, the important thing that we are trying to convey is that uh, this project is not a research project, it's a project that really uh, focuses on the scaling of existing technologies. We need to make impact in the field and uh, we're not taking time right now to look at new things, to proof of concepts, we want to really take things that are ready for the farmers and for the private sector. So it's important to underline also that the private sector is here and that we really need this partnership to make sure that these technologies are moving. So that is the target of Africa Rice and this project in particular. Uh, it's, it's by all means a, a, a type of partnership that we want to promote to make sure that slowly but surely we are making a difference in the farmer's field and that we are increasing the self-sufficiency uh, in rice production in Africa. The money that is spent in imports uh, for rice is uh, really too much. We have done a lot of progress in research and in old scaling already, but it's not enough. We need to be much more uh, active and make sure that very soon, as we deserve, we are making uh, those countries self-sufficient. Obviously varieties are uh, paramount and important because we need to replace those existing varieties but there are other technologies like uh, uh, technology based on uh, digital uh, technologies for service providers for example to be able to make good recommendation on uh, the needs to use optimal level of fertilizers uh, this technology is called Rice Advice. It has been well received uh, and tested in many countries already. We want that to move forward. Another example is related to uh, uh, rice parboiling. Uh, we have also more uh, demand from the private sector in that respect. And uh, this is an important technology to create job opportunities, and particularly for women and at the same time uh, to make sure that there is less drudgery and that there is more efficiency in uh, uh, a rice that has a plus also in terms of organoleptic and uh, uh, health properties. Then um, the good agronomic practices, that is also a package of uh, recommendation that uh, proved to be useful. It's maybe a bit more difficult because it's a package of technology that is uh, uh, requiring more knowledge. But uh, we have also uh, our scientists uh, contributing on, on, on the development of those uh, recommendations, which can be taken up uh, by our partners and by farmers uh, right away. In, in this project, uh, we have uh, uh, different value chains that are uh, approached. We are obviously because it's our comparative advantage in charge of the rice value chain, but uh, we have other centers involved, for example, uh, uh, IITA, uh, centers who are working more at the level of, uh, of uh, uh, support in terms of uh, water control, like IMWI, uh, ILRI is also involved, depending on the different uh, areas. ICARDA is also involved for other crops.